One of the biggest problems in the life sciences, whether it's in basic research, in clinical research, or translational research, is our lack of informatics infrastructure. There is a mountain of data out there that, if organized and organized well, provides an incredibly powerful resource for all professionals uh, within these organizations. So uh, the clinical researchers uh, having access to the, to the medical record data, having access uh, to tests, uh, whether they be uh, radiologists or clinical labs or genetic tests, um, if all of that information is organized in an appropriate way and can be shared uh, in a way that protects the, uh, the, the privacy uh, and the confidentiality of the patient with the research community, we can begin to work on the diseases that directly affect the people who are in the hospitals in our neighborhoods. In order to be able to do that, we have to be able to have informatics infrastructure. What Cabrin has uh, brought to this university and to the state and to young uh, researchers such as myself uh, are the resources so that we can begin to think about how to make that happen. Uh, within the university, people such as myself, such as uh, uh, Dr. Eric Rochka, uh, have been able to form productive, collaborative relationships. Um, we're both informaticists. We've been able to reach out uh, to, base, to other basic researchers to broaden the scope of what it is that they do to include the use of this technology to bring us one step closer to realizing the vision of translational research.